Hey there, everyone, this is Al Calb and Sonic Rider Zero Gravity, and, uh... At my big surprise, a lot of people who are big fans of this game seem to be really insisting that I... Keep going through the t tutorial like I've always expressed my preference into learning how to play a game by playing the game, you know? Learning on my own, but no, there's been a kind of a push for me to Doing tutorials, so I guess that's what we're doing. We're learning about the meteor burst and more I uh, Okay, all right connect with floating objects during a gravity dot. Oh, I did that yesterday with train pieces uh, Okay, so the way it works is we're in practice mode. We're gonna go. Uh huh. And so I'm gonna R1. And then I'm supposed to like smash into that. And that makes me go faster. Sweet. Which doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. So you want to collide with things? Yeah, that is like not the most um, obvious concept, honestly. Uh, Oh, right, I'm supposed to do that. <laughs> kind of forgot. It's kind of embarrassing. And you're like, yeah, hit that train. Sweet. Okay. All right. Collide on something and you will go better. I guess that's why people are like, oh, cow, read, read the instructions. Because, yeah, no. Learning to smash into stuff to go faster just does not make sense. Uh, all right, gravity control. Do you like to control gravity? Well, gravity controls can even race along walls. Press and hold, which is square. This, okay, the air pin button. Mid trick to activate gravity control. Use the left mouse to orient yourself with the wall and release. Ooh, all right, well, there we go, Tails. You're gonna teach us how that works. So you go here a lot of, okay, so there's my wall, right? So you wanna do that? I don't think I did it. Um, alright, so this is why we get practice mode, is so that we can practice things. So you go here, then you go like, whoa, like that. Whoa! Hmm, okay, so I don't think I did that well. Learning, learning. So right on the wall, there you go, and now you're just riding on the wall. Is there a clear indication when something is wall riding? Yeah, I did see that. I don't know if I understand it, but I clearly saw it. <laughs> okay, so the big difference is you don't have a ghost in these little... So you're just supposed to like go up this ramp. Ooh. Like if they always have big red arrows like that, like okay, I guess I mean... I guess you just have to look. Like you just have to look at the scenery around yourself. And you're like, all right, okay, that kind of looks like it could be a wall. And then you do that. Hmm. Okay, it adds some form of, like, puzzle aspect to the race. Here's how to learn. Yeah, I learned how to grind yesterday. You need to not mix it up with a wall. <laughs> yeah, it just so it's to grind, so have some rings, then you evolve to grind mode, and then you just jump on it, and you're good. Here, my grind lord is all okay. I gotta activate it. Then you get here. It's like there's a button. You're grinding. And there you grind again. It's very easy. You don't have to like time two different things. So this is a lot easier than it was in the original game. I have to say. Maybe I. I mean, they basically made it like kind of a thing into a thing that you don't really have to think about too much. Like you just jump. You don't have to like press a button. Whoa, like I did there to re-land. Like, luckily the game let me keep it. Even though, uh, you know? Even though you know. Yeah, it's no better way to put that, I don't think. Alright, well these are just steaming through them. There's more. Bike and wheel. Muster way through obstacles with the bike. Using a bicycle. Alright, you can send obstacles flying for riding bike or wheel. Select bike. Can destroy obstacles. Okay, so it's power. Okay, so basically, yeah, this is power. Gear change. Yeah, gear change. I'm riding a bike now, and I'm gonna smash these cars. Yeah, knuckles. No <laughs> I have aggression problems. <laughs> we still don't make light. I look like plastic. All right. Why is it called? Bi yeah. Okay. Yeah. He does kind of sit down on like the gear itself transforms no into a bike. 
kind of goes really fast, but you can punch cars, so, you know. Honestly, maybe the safest option out there on the road. For yourself, like they're saying. Here's the air ride. Okay, and that's probably, so like, you know, like, like grind is Sonic's thing. Like the power, the speed, and this is gonna be air zone. You can take a sky if you're aboard an air rider. First, sail some rain. Digivolve into air ride. When selected, you can use the catapults to soar skyward. Okay. Check it out. Whoosh. Oh, is that a catapult? Oh, those. All right, let's uh, restart. I was holding back, which probably drove my nose downward. Uh, I was holding forward, rather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It ain't gonna go like, whoa. It's like a plane. It's reversed the way it should be. Here we go. Oh, yeah, look at that. Like, now is like his whole thing is like this weird, awkward, uh,. Anchor thing. Yeah, it starts as a board. Like, whomp, he grows like wings. Alright, whoosh. You don't need to press anything. They kind of go to each ring directly. Like, you don't have to correct because this is a tutorial. They're just like, hey, fly and ring now. Uh, and I get it. I've learned how to use the three major sources of calcium in the human body. There we go. This was the hands on course. And this is gonna be today's episode. Uh, today we've learned how to play the game. See, the reason I didn't want to go into the whole thing about learning about all the tutorial is this looks like there's gonna be like five more. I guess that's just not the case though. <laughs>